Here's a Lenovo 100e Chromebook. So, hi, so what's special about this one? So, what we've taken with our Chromebook strategy is we said, right, this shouldn't be sort of consumer devices that just put into the enterprise and education space. These have been designed around customer feedback to be durable, uh, to be resistant, and basically to be kid proof at the end of the day. So, spill resistant keyboard, we've got drain holes, they're impact and drop tested. So, you know, they're designed to last even though they're at a very uh, appealing price point. Has a nice big mouse pad. 100E seems to be that's a, that's the cheapest one of them of the of the generation. Like 100E, 300E, 500E. That means it's the entry level. Or cheap, it? cheap kind of devalues it. We'd say at an entry level price point. Entry level. So it's even more affordable than some of the other one. What kind of yes. pricing are we talking about? Uh, it's so new. I don't know to be honest. Yeah. It, we literally have launched them at this event, but I'm not sure of the actual price points. There's a nice little bump right here. I feel for I like, kind of like it's nice for gra to grab it, but also. On the table, it doesn't doesn't move around. Now, can we check the ports? Certainly. So we've got USB-C, we've got USB-3, which is uh, power out as well for charging, and USB-C on this side as well, because if you were connected it to power it up, you should still have another port for future proofing, combo headset, micro SD, and another USB-3. And with an Intel Celeron type uh, processor mm -hmm. and uh, smooth uh, Chrome support right here, Available not only in the US but uh, in Europe. Globe. These are all global products, so global. they're available all around the world.